everybody, this is Ryan from CNR Reviews. Just wanted to take a little bit of time today to talk about the Aluma Grips, the custom Aluma Grips that I picked up from alumagrips.com. I don't know if you guys can see the the design on those there, but uh, it's a bat signal. Um, it's pretty cool. I'm a I'm a big Batman fan. If you guys haven't noticed from some of our videos, uh, I'm either wearing a Batman shirt or in some of the back of them, um, I have a, a Batman painted on my basement wall. <laughs> so, um, anyway, these are the only ones that I've ever seen. I had to get these custom made from Maluma Grips, uh, and they'll laser etch it here um, onto the grip. Now, when they say Aluma Grips, they are aluminum grips. They are metal. Um, this is not a plastic piece of crap grip. This is a, a really tough grip. Um, and it's just solid. They come also in, a, in a, a lightweight version where this is all hollowed out inside. And they also come with a slimline version which is a lot thinner than this. The only problem um, with that is you have to change your bushings out to put smaller, like shorter bushings so you can put the slimline grips on. I chose the standard grips with the standard checkering. Um, you can get you can get it with a, a, a more aggressive checkering, and they said that uh, they actually recommend that you that that uh, I mean this this is good for the normal person. The next step up is for like police officers, things like that. Really need a good strong grip, and then the next one up is like military only. Um, you have to wear shooting gloves or it's going to take some skin off of your hand. It's so aggressive. Um, I just went with the standard because I don't, I don't really need anything super crazy on my grip. Um, and then I went with the true oval shape here. They have a whole bunch of different shapes. They have circles or a, um, a, a different type of an oval. I think one of them has like a, a, a delta sign in it, like a, like a triangle. Um, and uh, some of them don't have this check ring. They just are, are flat, and you can get whatever design you want on there. You just send them a picture, um, and they'll tell you if they can do the design or not. Um, Chris over at Illumagrips.com, you just send him the email, and he'll respond to you. Well, he responded to me within about 20, 30 minutes um, to get it all done. And uh, he, he said that it was going to take two to four weeks to get these laser etched and sent out to me, um, it took about two weeks. So, um, and they came in the mail nicely, uh, nicely wrapped, and uh, this goes straight on the Kimber here, very nice and tight. Uses the um, uses the the factory bushings, so and the factory screws. Just kind of, whoops. Sorry if you guys can't see the bat signal very well, but I just cleaned the gun and it got a whole bunch of oil on the on the grips here. And unfortunately, it does darken the the design a little bit. Um, one of the things I, I noticed about it is even holding it in my hand for a long period of time, just the moisture from the sweat on your hand will make the the, the image darken a little bit. But um, you can see I have it on both sides. They don't come loose, from what I've noticed. Um, there's, they stay nice and tight. Um, they look really good on the gun. Of course, I have my little pushing compensator on here, just for, uh, just for shits and giggles. Um, but yeah, they cost about, let me see here, I think mine cost about $85 for these. But this is a permanent grip that you can, I mean, you can pretty much do anything with it. It's going to stand up to the test of time. It's not some some rubber thing or some 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 wood thing that's gonna get scratched. Um, this is metal. It's gonna stay. It's gonna stand up. So um, and again, you can get whatever design you want. If you like custom, if you just want straight, they have them a bunch of different colors. I know they have um, straight aluminum, like polished aluminum. I know they have the OD green. Uh, I think they have a dark earth tan color also um, that you can get. I just went with the straight black. Um, but you can get colored designs from different different places and, and you know things like that. It's not only Aluma Grips. I I went through AlumaGrips.com. Um, there's a there's a few other ones like Wicked Grips, I believe. But you gotta you gotta wait. Um, they they're they're really in high demand and you gotta wait a long time to get them. So 
Um, again, mine were about $85. I believe they go anywhere from, I want to say they started at about $60, $70, bucks, and then depending on your options, um, again, if they got to hollow out the inside, it's a little bit more effort. Um, and then uh, if they do engraving rather than laser etching, it's it's probably a little bit less. If they don't do anything on it, <laughs> then it's going to be a little bit less. I believe they go they go from about sixty to seventy dollars, and then depending on your options, they can go up to about one hundred and ten, hundred and twenty dollars. So um, depending on on what you want to get, I mean, again, I got a pretty cool set of grips here, and uh, I mean they only cost me eighty five bucks. So and I mean it's it's something permanent to make my Kimber look badass. So anyway, if you guys want a cool pair of grips, check out Aluma alumagrips.com. Um, Chris is really friendly over there. He'll give you his, cell, his uh, uh, cell phone number, his email address. Ask him any question, um, and he'll respond to you pretty quickly. So. Thanks.